children in this video what all i wrote towards the uh, end of this explanation in the end it's not essential it was just to show you so i could see towards end later on that this is not visible the part at the bottom is not visible uh, it's not essential but when i'm sending you the notes this part is there actually when i wrote it for you to explain the question this part was not there and i set my camera accordingly but uh, then when i started explaining you so you know in a flow i just wrote afterwards for you uh, which actually i should have not written because camera is set accordingly but then children never mind i hope the, uh, the numerical is clear to you and i'm sending you a, a photo of this so that you can understand what i wrote later on although if it is not visible it's not the essential part because from here only you can see how i got the value of this formula t is equal to delta h upon t delta s y because when i am taking delta g zero so you can see delta h will be equal to 2 t delta s and from there i got this formula t is equal to delta h upon delta s so i was trying to show you this also so i hope uh, it was not confusing i have solved it and this portion you can see in the notes later on Uh, this is slightly not visible in the video. I have noticed later on, but children, uh, I think it's further not uh, required to redo the whole thing. I just told you that you will see to it, okay, in the notes. And this part is there, although it's not essential to be shown there. It is very much clear from here. It was just to explain you, so you just see to it, okay.